welcome back to my channel. I am Jerry Del Vento and I'm so excited you're tuning into today's video. Thanks for stopping by. If this is your first time here, thank you. Don't forget to subscribe um, and like this video. Let me know in the comments which art print was your favorite. So for today's video, we're gonna talk about how to refresh your gallery wall. If you've been following me for a little bit, you know that I have a gallery wall in my house and um, I've shown it, I have a house tour, you probably can see it there, but I'm actually gonna give it a little revamp and a refresh. So with the help of Minted, I got sent some beautiful art prints that I got to choose from their Fine Arts Limited Edition, which is so cool. I love that Minted supports artists through each purchase. So it's so cool. You can choose your frame, metal, wood, you can make it into canvas. I mean, you name it. There's so many options that Minted gives you, but I'm actually gonna show you what the final product looks like. So this is it. Look how beautiful it turned out. I have this gallery wall here for a little bit, actually. This um, buffet is a server. I actually padded and I didn't know what to do on top of it, so I added a gallery wall probably about a year and a half ago. And then now I decided to give it a little refresh, which I feel like you should probably you know, change your art prints every year or so. It kind of gives a new like perspective to the room. For the first time I walked into the room today and I was like, wow, it looks so different. So what I did is that I went based off my color palette that I currently have in my house. And then I went choosing each art. I have obviously, because I'm an interior designer, I was able to lay it out on a program that, you know, I was able to, to see it, but Minted actually gives you that option as well, which is so cool. So you're able to kind of pick your pieces, take a picture of your room and see how it looks on your walls. So the first thing that I did is that I actually picked this one because I really love just the scribble scrabble kind of feels, you know, feels like my, my child did it. You know, it's just the organic abstract look. Then I picked this one in a 24 by 30 and then making it the biggest size. And then I went up from there into the size. So I picked, I first went here. Then my second one that I picked was this one just because I love the deep blue tones. We have some blue, or my, I would say my darkest color in my house would be this blues here throughout. Then I went into here, which is more of like an abstract sunset kind of watercolor scenery feel i didn't have anything like this before so i thought it would be a good addition to the bunch then i went into this one which is just as you can see brush strokes abstract brush strokes it literally has all the colors that i have in my home so it just i felt like it went perfect and it didn't really look like anything else that i had already picked then last but not least i really like this one I wanted something a little bit more bold, but yet not overpowering. That's why I chose this one in an 11 by 14. And um, yeah, it just kind of felt like it worked together. It's kind of my style, abstract, organic, watercolors, brush strokes. That's the look that I was going for. And yeah, Minted made it possible and I love it. Um, and I also got the frames from them. So like I said, you can choose so many different style frames different style um, colors and canvas. You can actually make this into a huge canvas if you wanted to. So it's really great. I really love how it turned out. What do you think? Which one is your favorite piece? Why don't you let me know in the comments? Thank you so much for watching this little how to refresh your gallery wall.